One other thing I should point out is that when you get to the end of the application, one of the last questions they ask you about is if there's a minimum request or if you receive less than that amount that you wouldn't be able to actually deploy it. And the way the CDFI fund uses this is if you're recommended for a lower dollar amount, maybe you put down 50 million and the recommendation from the reviewers is that you should get 45 million. Well, what will happen is you'll get zero. And you'll get absolutely zero. And we've heard of that happening before. We're aware of it happening before. And the CDFI fund has actually stated that it has happened on occasions. So you notice here, the example, 20 million is your minimum, and they recommend 18. Well, you get nothing. So my advice to you is, if you're going to pick a minimum, pick a low minimum. And in general, I would be very cautious about picking a minimum at all. Because the worst case scenario is they give you a small award, and you just decide, you know what, I can't do anything with that size of an award. And so you give it back to the CDFI fund. You can make that decision when you get there about what the real minimum is that you can live with. And my guess is that maybe today you're thinking, if I get less than 10 million, it just isn't going to work. I can't live with that. No way, no how. And my guess is if you thought about it long enough and hard enough, you could find a way to make 9 million work or 8 million or 7. And there's probably some lower point that you could find a way to make work. So I would guess really low if I was going to put anything in at all. In fact, our recommendation as a firm is to not have a minimum because generally speaking, you can either find a way to make it work or you can go back to the CDFI fund and say, you know, that's not enough for me. I really can't make it work.